dear students welcome back to my channel this video for the students of class 4b we were in the chapter division that is in your sixth number chapter in the previous video we have discussed about exercise 6.1 and division by 10 100 and 1000 today in this video session we will discuss about division by two digit number without remainder with remainder and exercise 6.3 before starting this topic exercise 6.2 the all problems you have to do in your copy we discussed about all the types clear so you have to try you have to solve in your copy by yourself so now let's start with our new topic that is division by two digit number without remember remainder and we will do the long division method okay so at first you have to choose or you have to take an example suppose divide 325 by 16 okay so here we will do or we will use the long division method clear so at first you have to write in this manner so 385 this is dividend and 16 is divisor now how to solve so at first you have to take the first digit from the left side so if you choose 3 so you can't divide because 3 is less than 16 so you have to take 38 as a dividend clear now what should you multiply by 16 to get nearest to the 38 you know that means you have to know about the table of 16 you know 16 to the 16 ones are 16 16 to two the 32 and 16 three the 48 so 16 three the 48 means which is beyond 38 so you have to use 16 to the 32 which is nearest to the 38 so write down 2 in the quotient and write 32 here now subtract so 8 minus 2 is 6 and 3 minus 3 is 0 now 6 is less than 16 so you can't divide so bring down 5 from the dividend now 65 is your dividend now what should you multiply by 16 to get nearest to the 65 you know so 3 16 is a 48 4 16 is a 64 so it will come 64 if you now subtract you will get 1 so the now quotient is 24 and remainder is 1 so this is the example of division by a two digit number 
with rem with remainder okay now check your answer you know how to check dividend equal to quotient into divisor plus remainder you know the rule so i want to use this rule so here quotient is 24 divisor is 16 and remainder is 1 if i get the dividend then our answer is right so now we have to multiply 24 by 16 24 and 16 you know 6 for the 24 so write down 4 and carry 2 6 to the 12 12 plus 2 is 14 then 0 4 ones are 4 and 2 ones are 2 so 4 8 and 3 so this is 384 and add plus 1 you will get 385 is this your div dividend let me check yes this is our dividend so our division is right this is the way to check your answer clear now i will give you an example that is the division by a two digit number without remainder suppose i am taking divide 925 by 37 925 by 37 so how to divide so at first you have to write in this manner clear where 92 925 is dividend 37 is divisor so first of first one we have to tick 9 since 9 is less than 37 so you have to choose 92 as a dividend so now what should you multiply by 37 that you get uh, to the nearest number of 92 so you have to know about the table of 37 so 37 ones are 37 37 twos are 2 sevens are 14 and 3 to the 6 plus 1 is 7 and 37 3 is a 3 7 is a 21 3 7 is a 21 and carry 2 3 3 is a 9 and 9 plus 2 is 11 so which is if you multiply by 3 so you will get 111 which is beyond 92 so you have to write here 2 and here 74 which is nearest to the 92 so now subtract so you know so it will be 8 and it will be 18 now 18 is less than 7 37 so you can't uh, you can't divide so bring down 5 now uh again you have to divide 125 by 37 so 37 forza we will use the same thing same logic so 4 are 28 and 3 forza 12 12 plus 2 is 48 and 3 7 is a 5 37 into 5 you will get 185 so in the quotient you have to write 5 and in the dividend you have to write 185 if you subtract you will get 0 that is you are getting the remainder as 0 
that means this is the this is an example of division without remainder now check your answer how to check your answer i told you so dividend equal to quotient into divisor divisor uh, plus remainder you know quotient is 25 divisor is 37 and remainder is 0 if you get 925 then your answer is right so you have to multiply 5 7s are 35 so carry 3 3 5s are 15 15 plus 3 is 18 now it is 0 7 2s are 14 and carry 1 and 3 2s are 6 6 plus 1 is 7 so 5 8 plus 4 is 12 7 plus 1 is 8 8 plus is 9 yes this is your dividend because uh, this is 925 so this is the way to divide uh, a number by two digit number with re remainder and without remainder now we are going to the exercise six uh, six point three exercise six point three now question number one i have written so you have to solve that means you have to fill up these boxes so since in the quotient it is one that means you are multiplying by one by 56 you are multiplying 56 by one so you will get here 56 so in this box in the in this box 5 will come so now subtract you know you are uh, subtracting 1 from 6 so it will be 5 you know the subtraction i am doing the same thing so it will be 15 okay now it is 15 since 15 is less than 500 uh, uh, 56 so you have to bring the you have to bring down 8 now your dividend is 158 clear 158 now you have to choose the number that should multiply by 56 to get nearest to the 158 but in this question in the ones place the 2 is given now you have to search where do you get 2 after multiplication by after multiple after, after multiplication by 56 you know if you multiply by 7 what will you get 6 7 is a 12 42 sorry 6 7 is a 42 so carry 4 5 7 is a 35 35 plus 4 is 392 which is beyond 152 and how did you get 2 if you multiply by 2 so it's 6 12 6 to the 12 6 to the 12 and carry 1 and 5 to the 10 10 plus 1 is 11 so i think it will be your turn so in this quotient 2 will come and here 112 will come okay so now 8 minus 2 is 6 and 5 minus 4 is 5 minus 1 is 4 and you know here the remainder is 46 which is less than 56 so our division is right okay so this is the way to fill up your boxes in division method that is a long division method now question number b this is your home task you have to do in your copy please go through this uh, video and try to solve i am now solving question number c 
Now I'm solving question number C. So it is in the dividend. It is given 42 and two boxes. In the quotient, one is given and there, there are two boxes. And in the divisor is 24. Since uh, you have to take 42 and in the quotient, it is, it is given 1. That means you have to multiply 24 by 1. So you will get 24. 24 ones are 24. So in this bracket, it will come 24. Then, if you subtract, you will get 18. Because 42 minus 24 is 18. Since you are bringing down 8, so in the dividend, it will be 8. Okay. So now, it is 188. Now, you have to find out a number which is nearest to the 188 by multiply by 24. Through multiplication by 24. Okay. So, 24, if you multiply 24 by 3, so you will get 3 fours are 12 and 3 twos are 6 plus 1 is 72. You should have to get 8. So, if you multiply by 7, because 4 7s are 28, so it will be, if you multiply 24 by 7, you will get 24, uh, 4 7s are 28, so carry 2, and 7 2s are 14, 14 plus 2 is 16. So here it will, it will come 16, that means 168, and in the quotient it will come 7. Now if you subtract you will get 8, 8 minus 8 is 0 and 8 minus 6 is 2. So it's matching. Now you are bringing down number 5. That means in the dividend in this question it will be 5. Now you have to find out to the nearest number 205 uh, multiplying by 24. So, you know, here you have to find in the 1's place 2. So, what should you multiply by 24 that you get in the 1's place you will, uh, in the 1's place, in the 1's place you will get 2. Yes, 24 into 3 you will get 72. But here it is given 3 digit number, so it will be not if you multiply 24, if you multiply by 8, so you will get 8 for the 32, carry 2, 8 to the 16 and 16 plus 3 is 19, which is nearest to the, so, you know, 5 minus 2 is 3, and since you are, uh, you have written 192, and you will get 192 uh, multiplication by 8. So in the quotient, it will be 8. So this is your required answer. How to fill up. Now, your turn. You have to do all the questions of this exercise. And I think you will do. Uh, try to learn. And try to learn all the method and try to solve all the questions that is 2, 3, 4. Please do it and this is your home task. Do it in your copy. Go through this video and try to do all the sums, division sums in your copy. So thank you. See you on the next video.